So, hello and welcome back. And this tutorial will be about C tags, which is mainly used to jump to the definition of a function, a call, or anything. Um, with Wim, C tags is a pretty dumb tool, so there are sometimes um, multiple matches where you have to select the right one, and so just as a heads up. But right now, I will just show you how to use it. So, first of all, we need to create a new def uh, new function or anything that we can actually find the definition of. So just call this um, just something very simple. Just something like that, right? And first of all, to use C tags, we need to install program C tags, which we can do with Paro again. And after we've downloaded it, we can um, create a C text file um, on the current directory because we are already in the source directory. So uh, minus R stands for recursively. Um, in this case, it's not needed, but if we had any subdirectories, um, then uh, it would recurse and also get a uh, generate tags on that invalid invalid option. Or oh, of course, I did mean to write that c tags minus r for recursive and then the dot for the current working directory and now we should have a text file right here if we can if we take a look at this we can see something like this now to use the text file we can set tags to the text file we've just generated and then we can use um, control and then closing um, brackets, the square brackets, that is, so, um, control and then the closing brackets to go to the definition. And as in the previous video, you can always um, go back in the jump stack with control capital O and go forward to the jump stack with control capital I. And if you want to see all matches for this, um, for this tag that was created, you can also hit G and then closing bracket like this and then there is a new window we can um, have we have a selection now where we can enter a number um, which one we want to open so we there's only one in this case so we just enter one as our selection and then we end up at the def definition here and yeah that's basically already it again this uh, will become re really helpful in bigger projects for now it's just to show you how it works I hope this has been useful again and yeah, see you next time.